Yo, what's up, it's the Dark Horse. Welcome. We're going to be jumping into another member duel. Me and Cristiano running two different decks. I've never ran this deck before. Obviously, we've learned it like by playing. Oh, uh, not even playing. We got absolutely shredded by it. So hopefully, I can play it as well as this person did. There's only one way to find out. Let's get into it. All right. Okay. Um, is uh. I was just trying to think. I forgot that I was in a Discord call <laughs> with my cousin. <laughs> his computer's messing up with his mic, so he's probably heard that whole intro. <laughs> but yeah, it's all good. Obviously, you know, fate decided on where we were going first, second, or whatever. The way I view it, first duel would be a test run, second duel would be a proper serious play, and third duel would determine the winner. Depending, obviously, how it plays out. Uh, this loading screen is taking quite a while. So, for some apparent reason, it couldn't connect to the server. So, it kind of thingy, but... Uh, we'll go first again. We'll keep it fair. Technically, hypothetically, we would chose to go first. So, we can kind of see... I honestly don't know how to run this. Um, okay. Right, okay. Um... Control your special miss card from the end if you could only if the only other monster you control is exactly one dark type single your special of two resonators. This guy one resonator monster add one level four or lower fiend monster from your deck to your hand. Right. This guy one resonator add one level four or lower fiend monster from your deck to your hand. But the thing is, as much as I want to discard this, I don't know how. If you control no monsters, you can special summon this card from your hand. Okay. Let's special summon it. No. We'll put it in defense mode. I then, if you control a fiend, you special summon this card. You special summon this way. You cannot special summon monsters from the extra except synchro monster in your main phase. Except turn this card to central. You banish the card. Okay. Wait, hold up. During the main phase, except to turn this card since grave, you can banish this card, add one fiend. Okay. We're going to special summon into Red Rising Dragon. What is going on? Why, why wouldn't it just let me select it the other way? But okay. Right, Red Rising Dragon comes out. Activate your effect. Allowing me to target a Resonator in the graveyard. Special summon. Right, you can special summon two resonators from your hand or deck. Okay, activate Crimson Resonator's effect. Um, this card is normal special summon. You can special summon a level four monster from your hand. I don't have any. Uh, based upon this, I honestly don't know. Um, if a synchronous on a fully special summon card, if this card is sent to the graveyard, you can target one resonator in your graveyard. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go with these. I don't know if I'm doing this right. But we will basically work with it and see how it goes. Okay, in doing that, I can then special summon into... Uh -huh, I don't know what I'm doing. If you do, add one card, excavate. Well, technically, I could go into... Yeah. So if I go that... Yeah. And then put that into attack mode for Chaos Ruler... Yeah. Activate Chaos Ruler. Add the designated card to your hand. Well, if you could synchronize on the food, you can special summon this card from your hand. Yeah. Discard, add one level four resonator. Okay. Well, I could, could hypothetically... I don't know what one's more important. You could tribute one monster to tag one red dragon that's reading in the grave of special summon it when this card inflicts battle damage you can special summon. Once per turn, you can tag one face and negate its effects and when this card inflicts battle damage. Okay, let me special summon this. In defense mode. I honestly feel bad. I do apologize for this because, you know, I'm not exactly running this in an incredible way. Let's go with these. What? Why is it running so slow? I'm trying to click the cards and it's like glitching and stuff. 
Red Supernova. Okay, cannot be sure your opponent's card effects when your opponent activates. Once per turn, this card is sent to grave, you take one resonate in your graveyard, add it to your hand, activate the effect of Synchron Resonator, and I will go for you. Oh, balls, I was supposed to activate. <sighs> okay. Then I'm going to activate this and discard Crimson Resonator or a Crimson Resonator again. And then basically I'll set that card face down and I call it a turn. I honestly don't know what I'm doing with this deck, so yeah. Um, I don't know. Bear with me. <laughs> I do apologize. Um, but yeah. Okay, what do we have here? Adventurers. Hmm. I'm going to activate Fate Trap, the uh, Trap Trick. No. Yeah, banish this trap card. Set it face down over there. I don't think I can go higher than 12, though. I can't. Okay. Um, okay, so the adventurers, obviously, they obtain cards based upon... Okay. Um, I haven't got a clue about adventurers at all. So, yeah. Um, this genuinely could be interesting. Okay, what do we have? Once per turn, the first time monster control and equips are destroyed by battle. It's not destroyed. You can only use the following during your main phase. You can add one monster that mentions adventure token from your deck to your hand. And then send one card from your hand to the graveyard. If a monster is normal, spend you can take it, equip. Uh, one equip spell that mentions adventure token from your deck and either add it to your hand or equip it. Okay. So what do we have? Helmer. Oh, combination of for hire and adventurers. Right. Uh, once per time an opponent's had a most of the order, but it's a pleasant attack. You can have banish this card. Oh, so banish cards. Oh, sheesh. That's crazy. Not yet. Not yet. Oh my. I forgot how cracked that is. I genuinely did. We're going to wait for him to bring out all the high almighty cards and then we're just going to clean up. That's crazy. Yo. He's a monster. Literally. Oh. Well played. Oh, yo. I got to give you that. Well played. Yo, no shot. Wait, I'm unaffected. I'm not destroyed. Yo. Can we just give a round of applause for that play? That play was absolutely phenomenal. I literally, well, you know what? Well played. Well played. Jesus. Wow. That. Slightly heartbreaking. <laughs> but Jesus. Okay, we need to... If we go with that, we have to play it very quickly. Mate. Oof. I don't know why I keep disconnecting, man. Like, bruh. I'm literally sat under the modem. Uh, from that play, I genuinely have no clue how I can play this. Okay, well, technically speaking, what do we have here? We banish the cavern, we're going to target two level one resonator special summon both. Uh, during my phase, you can banish this card. Okay. 
Banish. We want to have... Yeah, Crimson Resonator. Right, okay. So, wait. Uh, you can banish this card from your graveyard and take one Resonator monster in your... On level one, special summon both. I'm going to start by normal summoning. Activating its effect. I don't know how I'm going to benefit from this. Wait, if I go straight into 10, I'm probably going to Bane, not Bane, Tyrant. Or I go in this one. Why is it not letting me target? Is this how synchros work? You have to target the tuna before the synchro monster. If I banish, I can special some two level ones. You know what? It's not... Obviously, you don't really want to go into Link Monsters, but yeah. You could tribute one monster tag, one red dragon, arch fiend, monster in the graveyard, special summon. I don't... I don't have one at the moment, unfortunately, but yeah. Uh, we'll special summon... I don't know if I'm playing this right. Right. For the rest of this turn. For the rest of this turn, your opponent can activate cards. Also, cards your opponent control and activate their effects. Yeah? If this card is sent to the graveyard, you can play one. Yeah, okay, okay. I get one resonate. If you control. Okay, special summon. Close my door, please. I don't know if you can activate both of these, but if I can, then this could actually work quite effectively. I oh, mean, I don't combo ever, ever. So this is a first for me, man. Obviously, once I kind of become familiar with the deck, obviously, as everyone's aware, I'm not really a big synchro kind of duelist. But yeah, activate the effects. Yeah. Banish you. And then give me initial summoned. Okay, if it's special summoned. Cool. Right, proceed to the battle phase. Technically, no cards can really be activated, but yeah. Um, I'm going to destroy you. Oh, it can't be destroyed. Okay, then. I'm learning something new here. Oh, my God. Does that mean... Yo. Well played. You know what? That's actually mad, you know. Not something I personally would run myself, but it's interesting to have Fateful Adventure and Draco back the Rideable Dragon. They seem to like be a deadly combo. I don't know what other spell trap cards are available with these, but yeah. 
It's interesting to see for hires being ran though. Uh, well, technically, I can't really fall by the grave anything, can I? All right. Okay. If this card is destroyed by a monster by battle, inflict damage to your opponent equal to. If this card is destroyed, you can target one. The problem is, is I'm never going to be destroyed. So that's the kind of thing I have to take into account. That spell card has to go ASAP. When we bring out our big Donny, we have no choice but to have to go with that sort of play um, and clear the field ASAP. Those spell cards have to go easily. But it's nice. <clears throat> uh, there's no point. Oh, technically, we've lost this one, yeah. So without that spell card, you're pretty much... You you can't do anything against me. Okay. So we're going to go, I think, second to go. We bring out Red Nova. We use his ability as soon as we can to make sure it's banished before... Yes, because if it's banished, then the protection's there during Christiane's turn. No. Obviously, I need to learn the effects. Once per turn, you can destroy as many special summon effects on the, on the field as possible. Mate, I need to actually go into that a bit more, you know. Oh, but technically... That's not, an that's not classed as an effect monster, is it? Okay. Whoa. Hot red. I'm, you know what? As much as I obviously uh, enjoy the idea of bringing uh, this out, we're going into hot red next time because hot red can destroy all attack position monsters, yeah? So if we go into hot red instead, I can destroy all of the face-up attack position monsters on the field as well. Then, obviously, I could possibly go into this if I needed to. Or... Tiger one effect negates fail and just kind of bit of damage. Um Yeah, okay, okay. We've got a work in progress. For our first time running this deck, I don't think it's been too bad. I think we've done quite well. Um obviously I feel like adventures are probably better on their own. But yeah. It's all good. The fire kind of gives it the uh added edge to it. But yeah. Okay. First duel done, duel two. Okay, so duel two, I've chose to go second. I don't know if that's an actual beneficial thing or it's not. Because hypothetically, as good as it could work, it might not work. Um, when it's, You can discard one card, especially this card from your hand, defense, then you can... Okay, that allows me to go into an eight star straight off the bat, which would allow me to possibly go into Chaos Ruler. Um... Or, yeah. We can see how this could probably play out. Um, going first is probably more beneficial, but then going second is kind of there. You know, because at least I can kind of see where... The more cards Christiane brings out, the better it is. If I can bring, obviously, the Nova out, we have to get Nova out, activate its effect, banish it, and then clear the field. And that way we don't have to worry. I think that's the pro uh, a best possible play to get a victory with this deck. But we'll have to wait and see. Hmm. Okay, so they're all for hires, aren't they? To be fair, for hires kind of remind me of... Um, for, um, Tri Brigade. I'm going to say Fire Brigade for a second then. I was thinking, what? Yeah, so based upon my play, I was a special. I go into 8 star, which probably allow me to go into Scarlet. Scarlight. Then I could destroy as many attack position monsters as possible. Okay. So they're only for hires. We do have Chain Resonator. Um, so let me go with this. Activate the effect. Let's have a look. Right. If Synchro is on the field, you can special summon. Okay. Depends on paste. Right. I'm going to discard this. Special summon. Special summon a monster. Into defense mode. Special summon. Right. Okay, this is a bit of a tough one because I've got... You can destroy other face-up attack position monsters. 
or I can go for you can destroy as many special summon effect monsters on the field as possible with attack less than or equal. Which I think is probably more logical because our field is basically full of them. So I'm gonna go in with Scarlight. Is that Scarlight? I believe it is. Yeah, it is Scarlight. Scarlight Red Dragon Arch Fiend comes out. I activate your effect. Gets destroyed. A thousand damage. I then. When you normal summon controls, you can special summon resonate from the deck. Yes. Normal summon. Activate your effect. We will then special summon this one. No. Uh, when it's called special summon. There we go. Special summon. Activate your effect, increasing my attack by 3,000 life points. Increase my attack, I mean life, yeah. I don't even know what I'm saying. Right, I can special summon to the field. I'm going to play Synchro Cool Face Down. Along with Trap Trick. And then going to special summon... Let's have a look at what we got here. You can target one face up monster, your opponent controls negate its effects. What is your effect? During your face special summon, if this monster is uh, okay. You can tribute one monster, target one red dragon arch fiend and monster in the graveyard, special summon it. Oh well technically that's cloud as a red dragon arch fiend, so I could special summon it back to the field. That's actually pretty mental, you know. During your main phase, destroy level cards foot also for the of monsters during your players' battle phase. When a spell trap is activated, you can negate the station. Okay. We'll go into this. Wait, have I just messed up? I think I messed up. Activate the effect. Tribute you. Special summon. To the field. Activate your effect. Special summon. What's the attack on you? 32. Okay. We go with this. Into Hot Red Dragon. Negate its effects. No. Proceed to the battle phase. Destroy. No. Activate your effect. Special summon. Uh, it's a bit of a shame, but yeah. No, right, okay. Honestly, I hate the fact I'm taking so long, but this deck just requires so much, like, brain power. What's the effect? Oh my god, wow. We go main phase two. Special summon. Jesus Christ. Mate, why is it so slow? And then into attack mode. Red Nova comes out. Activate your effect. Nah. All right, I am a turn there. Wow, this has been crazy. This genuinely has been absolutely mental. Very interesting concept and in deck. Um, 
it's weird how when you get into the flow of things, it's very like easy and beneficial to run. Um, I'm not going to activate it yet. Oh, I think she's handing herself over. Should we activate our monster's effect? Nah, I'll let her, I'll let her attack. Yeah. Mate, could you imagine if I just banished, cleaned her field out, and <laughs> just waited the turn? Nah, I'm not, that, I'm not that cruel. Right. Okay. Here we go. The final bout. The third duel. The determination of who wins the match duel. Um, obviously... If you've enjoyed it, like the video, subscribe to the channel, you know, and obviously subscribe to the second channel, which we, we post. Well, technically it's multiple channels, but I'm not even going to, whatever. Okay, I'm going, mate, I'm going second. I'm happy with that. I'm happy. As long as I can get, like, um, the card that can special summon a level three. This deck's crazy. Yeah, okay. Well, no, 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 this is fine. Oh, no, this is fine. I can normal summon, special summon, go five star wyvern, yes, whatever it's called, red rising, oh six I mean, six star, yeah, into red rising, special summon, go into eight, go into the activate the effect, destroy a special summon monsters, um, go into scarlight, and then destroy them, special summon, normal summon, sorry, we can make this work. Obviously, pulling two cool by the graves hasn't benefited me in any way, shape, or form, but uh, it could work. As long as the adventure doesn't come out, we should be okay. But obviously, as everyone's aware on this channel, I'm not a big fan of hybrid decks. Christiani does run hybrid decks. Um, so it, it's kind of nice to dual members to kind of see their insight of their types of decks, to be honest. So, yeah. Okay, so the for higher for 2800 defense is out. But then, see, oh, wait. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Okay, this could be a problem. I may possibly not special summon yet. I think what I'll do is go Crimson Resonator. Activates effect is it only once per turn. Oh, it is. Oh, you kept you got rid of Sage. Okay, Folgo. Folgo, Folgo. Okay, special one for high monster with a different type from the three monsters used for the synchro from your deck in defense mode. If a card your opponent controls is destroyed by battle a card effect, you draw one card. Then if you control three or more for hives with different names, draw two additional cards. Okay. See that Sage would have stumped me. Possibly. So I would have normal summoned. Special summoned. It would have negated it. I would have gone called by the grave. Remove the card. Depends. Does it have to be a monster? No. I think that for higher doesn't specify whether it could be spell or trap. So I don't know if it's for higher spell and traps or it's just monsters. Uh, yeah, so it's definitely. Um, okay. Well, let's see what this is about. Guys, special summon to clip 500 damage to your opponent. Oh, your opponent cannot target monsters for higher control with card effects, except this one. Okay. Right, we need to play this very smart now. <sighs> okay. Uh, well, which of the Black Forest is not bad? I could obviously add. If a higher monster you control, destroyed by battle or card effect, you could target one of those monsters. Special summon one monster. For Whoa. Okay. First off, we drop a special summon. In attack mode. Um, special summon. Normal summon. Special summon. Ryzen. Oh my god, you know, that place. Oh, that play. That play is going to be amazing. Oh my god, this is going to work. I think I've just 
kind of blown my own mind right now. Right, special summon in defense mode, yeah? Then this effect will activate, allow me to add another one. Yeah, technically. Maybe not. Uh, okay. We go Skylight. Obviously, I should have went with an alternative card, but it's fine. There you go. Chain it. Wow, shit. Or not. Wow. Hold up a minute. Pull by the grave. Remove you. No. Yeah, I should have went with a different approach. It's fine. It's fine because it's protection next turn. If things do go south, I can activate this card's effect, discard that special summon, add another resonator, link summon, uh, synchro summon, normal special summon the resonator, special summon two tokens, synchro into 12, go crimson supernova, attack... That, that that's possibly the play uh very interesting um and hard decision here um okay so a uh, joining my Phoenix special one for high from your hand if i'm supposed to somebody control this monster you could target one okay we'll special summon um uh, probably activate call by the grave again so what's the effect of this being a special summon? Do you remember your special summon? This guy's special summon you control. You can take one face up. One face up on the field. Destroy it. Well played. I'll give you that. Well played. Oh if, oh, if a monster for high risk special summon to your field where you control this monster. So the effect would have activated if I didn't get called by the grave out. Damn. Okay, so the called by the graves are coming clutch. They've come in handy. Don't get me wrong, this duel is intense. It's hard. We managed to pull through with a double victory, though, ladies and gentlemen. Take care of yourselves. See you guys next time. Like, subscribe, share. Peace.